There are certain things in the natural world that just seem so, for lack of a better term, otherworldly. There are so many natural landscapes, weather phenomena, unique flora and fauna that seem unreal. The more I travel and see of our vast planet, the more I realize just how diverse and incredible it is. One of the things that, despite growing up near them, never fail to take my breath away are redwood trees. For anyone unfamiliar with these absolute giants of the arboreal world, redwoods are a subfamily of coniferous trees that contain some of the largest and tallest trees in the world. There are a few subcategories within redwood, but generally speaking, these trees are huge and very wide as they can live for thousands of years. In fact, they don't even reach full maturity until they're 400 to 500 years old. They grow in a number of places in the Northern Hemisphere, but only in very small pockets. But the one I grew up around were part of a park and reserve. However, sequoia redwoods can be found all over BC, particularly on Vancouver Island and most people are familiar with the famously large redwoods, South Canada and Northern California along the coast. British Columbia's temperate rainforest climate makes it the ideal home for all sorts of trees and boasts some spectacular forests filled with massive old trees, but nothing else can quite stand up to the majesty of the redwood. These ancient trees can reach up to and over 300 feet tall. For context, that's taller than a 50-story building. These massive trees will house entire ecosystems within themselves and are known for their resilience. Despite their enduring qualities, the entire subfamily of redwoods is seen as endangered. They were heavily logged in the last century and due to their slow growth timeline and a variety of constant human-caused risks to their development and protection, these trees are rare and hard to come by. If you find yourself on the west coast of North America, take a trip to one of the ancient forests that house these grand trees. It is truly an experience unlike any other, like walking down the path into the world's natural history.